Hi guys, it's Mari and I've got a really, really quick video here for you today. And it's just, I'm doing a little bit of mixed media on some white cardstock just to create a 12 by 12 layout today. So I'm going to start off by using some archival black ink and a stamp and I'm just going to stamp this down in a couple of spots. It's just a really distressed looking stamp that's um, got some circles on it and I just really like the way that it looked and I, I thought it would be kind of cool for part of the background for this layout. So I'm just going to put it down and I'm going to then put my photo mat sort of like in between the two spots where I'm going to stamp here and I'm going to be using some Garden Fable paper from Prima and some of the different products that we got in our January hip kit and so you can see some of those different things off to the right there from my mind's eye my story and I just sized my paper down a little bit and I'm going to mount it onto that my mind's eye paper that had the gold arrows on it and I'm going to just use some of those my mind's eye rub-ons. I have a lot of trouble with these rub-ons. They don't want to go down completely. I don't know if it's because I have gesso on my paper but I knew I wanted to use some different stuff on here but I wasn't exactly sure what I was going to pull out of my mixed media bag of tricks there so I just um I wasn't really sure what, how if I needed to prep my paper or not but I did so that might be why my my um rub-ons didn't want to stick very well so I struggle with those a little bit but I finally get them down so there's a lot of gold accents on this layout for sure and just so that for anybody who's um, been watching my videos for a while I do often scrap my daughter's grad photos and I eventually will finish a 12 by 12 album for her and when I do get that all done I will do an album share with that so that you can see how everything sort of went together with all of the different layouts. Some of the photos I've definitely scrapped more than once and but that's okay because the layouts all look different and the messages are a little bit different on all of the, the different in the journaling on the different um, pages. So I'm just taking this crafters workshop stencil and I'm using some of the Heidi Swap gold metallic texture paste that we also got I think that was in the color kit maybe and I'm going to take some gold washi and just kind of rip some strips off of that for some more texture on the layout and this wasn't in this particular hip kit it was in one I don't know a few months back and there's the photo of my two most wonderful products <laughs> that I've ever had anything to do with on the planet my two kids and I'm so proud of them and this is a really great picture of them together on the day of Bailey's grad and I love this picture of the two of them they they just look so happy and yeah I like it so I wanted to scrap it on this layout today and I, I just printed it in black and white which just makes it a lot easier right to use a whole bunch of different things because you don't have to worry about the the colors in the photo so I just took some uh, stripped strips of pattern paper and I'm just going to put a little um, a little pop of turquoise in there from that basic gray paper and you know I'm almost done here you'll just see me add some little embellishments with some little um, enamel dots and so on on the layout and that little dream uh, piece that was in our, our kit and for the title and I've got a little brad on there for my mind's eye and you know what that's it it's really simple we also got these really cute little oh I'm just showing you there that little foil doily that I added that was from um, on trend too and now I'm just going to take those little acrylic blue dots that we got in the kit too and I'm just going to add a few of those around here and there in the layout. So you know what? This this is finished already. It's It was really simple, really easy to do and it didn't take me long. But I like the result. I think it's just clean and simple and um, and I like it. Thanks so much for joining me today. Have an amazing day. See you next time. Bye-bye.